Good afternoon, everybody. Meteorologist Carson Vickroy here with your web weather update. And yep, a few showers are possible this evening. That overall precipitation chance is relatively low, and it's low on Sunday, but with a little more instability in the atmosphere, there is a better storm chance as we head on into tomorrow. And then warm and dry weather is expected for most of next week after Monday. Here's what's keeping us warm. We have a ridge of high pressure that's located over parts of Utah and Colorado. And we're at the top of this ridge, so we're not having the dry weather that they're having down there. What we're dealing with is a storm system located over the state of Washington. This is a very weak disturbance that will be giving us a chance for rain through Monday of next week. Not morning rain, it will be mainly in the afternoon when we get that afternoon heating. Th that's what's going on right now. Closer look at our viewing area. Again, a few showers around Butte and even Bozeman. But again, only about 20% of the area is getting rainfall today. And that's going to continue here for the next several days. Let's take you hour by hour. As you can see, yeah, a few storms and showers are possible tonight. But that risk is low as we head on into Sunday morning. A few clouds are possible as we head on in to your morning hours for your Sunday. And then as we head into the afternoon, that's when we could start to see those showers and thunderstorms refire, especially to the west of our area, which is why we have about a 20 to 30 percent coverage for some showers and thunderstorms. Now there is at least a chance for some storms on Sunday. This is what we're looking at. I don't anticipate it to be a high chance. The risk is actually relatively low. Hail possible, possibly up to about a half inch size, but probably smaller. Winds up to 45 miles per hour. And from these storms in general, this will not increase our flooding risk, so that flooding risk is low. I'll have more updates at 5.30 and 10.